Okay, so welcome student. Um, today we will be discussing real life application of parabola. So we have here a problem. So a bridge shaped like a parabolic arc has a horizontal distance of 20 feet. So here we have a, a bridge that has a parabolic arc. Okay, so this is a bridge. Okay. Okay, and it is 20 feet apart. So if this is the ground, this is the ground, okay, and this is our origin. So this, thus this side of the arc is 10 feet, just 20 divided by two. And this side of the bridge is also 10 feet. So the center and the highest point of the arc is five feet above the ground. Okay, so we have five feet above the ground. So we have here five feet above the ground. So therefore, this point is our vertex, which is our x is zero and our y is five okay okay so vertex and also we have here a point so the, this is not uh it's point one point one and point two so any class but the, this is not the length of plato's rectum huh this is not the length of Plato's rectum, okay? And then, so thus, the coordinate of point one is x is 10 and y is zero. On the other side, point two, x is negative 10 and y is zero. So since parabola is not on the origin, we have the standard equation, the parabola opens downward x minus h squared equals negative 4c times y minus k. So our vertex is 0, 5. So we have the standard equation x minus 0 squared equals negative 4c times y minus 5. So we have x squared is equal to negative 4c times y minus 5. So our equation is not complete because we don't have the value of rc. So we need to solve 4c using the point on the parabola. So we have two points on parabola, point 1 and point 2. So you can choose either of the point but I will be choosing point one. So we have 10, zero. Okay, x is 10, that's 10 squared equals negative for c times y is zero, zero minus five. So we have 100 equals negative times negative, that's 20. 20c. Okay. Then divide both sides by 20. Okay. So 100 divided by 20 is equal to 5. Okay. So thus we can now substitute this value of our c to complete our standard equation. Standard. equation. So we have x squared equals negative 4 times 5 times y minus 5. So that's x squared equals negative 20 y minus 5. So this is our 
standard equation of the parabola. But since we are not yet done, the question is what is the height of the bridge at the point 5 feet from the center? So 5 feet from the center we have here. So this is 5 feet from the center. Question is ang height. So here we have x is 5 and y. So since height ato ang ipangita, if you're talking about distance, that's a variable x. If we're talking about height, that's a variable y. Also, on the other side, 5 feet away from the center, we have here. So thus, we have x is negative 5 and y is missing. So we need to find that. So we'll be using this coordinate. So find the height. Find the height. Uh, of bridge bridge at a point five feet from the the center. Okay, so we have five y. Okay, substituting the value, so we have x is 5, that's 5 squared, equals negative 20 times y minus 5. Okay, after that, that's 25 equals negative 20 y minus 5, and divide both sides by negative 20, negative 20. So cancel. So that's 25 divided by negative 20. That's equal to negative 1.25 equals y minus 5. So we need to transpose that. So it will become one, negative 1.25 plus 5 equals y. So that is... So, negative 1.25 plus 5, which equals to 3.75. So, therefore, y is equal to 3.75. So, the height of the bridge at 5 feet from the center is 3.75 feet. Okay, so that is all. Uh, don't forget to subscribe.